Hi, I am Dr. G. V. Nagarjuna Reddy. I am a consultant, head and neck surgical oncologist at Ma Hospitals, Jubilee Hills. Let us look into some myths about thyroid issues. The change in diet uh, is enough to control thyroid related issues. I would say no, not at all. Thyroid uh, issues cannot be controlled by diet alone, but uh, especially patients who are hypothyroid should avoid or should have decreased consumption of uh, vegetables such as cabbage, cauliflower and vegetables belonging to Brassicaceae family. It is good for them to have diet rich in iodine such as fish and etc. So thyroid issues cannot be resolved only by diet. It needs a proper evaluation with a thyroid function test and ultrasonography to check the function and structure of thyroid and would need appropriate medication according to the thyroid hormone levels. No, it is not absolutely true. There is some truth in it, but all weight gains are not because of thyroid uh, hormone issues. Especially in females, uh, the thyroid hormone uh, could be one of the uh, contributing factors. It is also related to other hormone issues during puberty, pregnancy, as well as menopause. And in males and females, it could be related to diabetes and other metabolic issues. Thyroid cancers are absolutely curable. Apparently, the thyroid cancer patients who have been treated have equal longevity and a good quality of life with the normal population. Our fourth myth is surgery is required for all thyroid issues. No, it is not absolutely true. Uh, surgery is not mandatory for all thyroid issues, especially benign thyroid lesions that, that are very small and which can be followed up on regular ultrasound do not require any surgery and nodules that are less than 1 cm do not have any high risk features can be followed up regularly uh, with a ultrasonography and thyroid hormone profile and patients who are suffering from thyroiditis will not require surgery uh, until and unless if they have any uh, abscess or any other lesion causing airway compromise. Uh, no, if the symptoms are relieved temporarily, if you skip or stop the medication, they will return with the increased uh, severity. Especially people who are hypothyroid, if you stop the uh, thyroid norm supplement, the symptoms will recur after 2-3 to three weeks and the effect of the tablet in the body or the half-life of a uh, thyroid norm tablet is gone. Anti-antagonist of thyroid hormones will recur with more severity of symptoms such as palpitations, tremors and neurological issues. So please don't stop your medication without a prior consultation with the, with the doctor.